Hello YouTube friends, welcome to Maria's Miscellany where this is the second part to a huge haul uh, that was Happy Mail from my friend Cynthia. Uh, <laughs> the first part was interrupted by a family um, yeah, issue. So anyway, we took care of it <laughs> and on to the next box. So I shared the first box in the first part of this video. Um, we're going to the next box and this next box has this a lovely piece of fabric and it looks like there's like a whole yard or more of it in here and it is so interesting because it's woodsy but it's purple and shiny and nice and thick so I'm I actually have an idea I just now thought of an idea of what I'm going to do with this and uh, at least one of the things I'm going to do with it because there's so much fabric in here that uh, a lot can be done with it okay and then, oh, check this out. So here, it looks like there is some embroidery that is probably unfinished. Look how cute that little, um, what do you call it? Pink cushion with a little tiny rick rack. Okay. And then some different threads. And let's look at this uh, fabric. Okay, so there's this. I don't know what kind of embroidery it this is. It says pure linen cut work centerpiece Vogue Needlecraft is what it says. I'm sorry I had to read it first before showing it to you. But look at this. It looks like it's meant to be embroidered right here. And and I've never seen this type of embroidery. Oh, I see. Man, that's a lot of work. Whoever started to do that. Did you start to do this, Cynthia? My goodness, look at some butterflies. You know, that's one of my favorite things is butterflies. That is beautiful. And actually, the butterfly part is complete. So I might be able to use that um, in a project as is. So, yay. Let me fold it real quick. And then there's, oh, how pretty. Look at this. Look at this. It's like a little embroidered frame. And... That is beautiful. It's not completely done, but it's something I'm, you know what? I, I haven't done any embroidery in a long time. It's something I might decide to finish off. Um, or even just that part that's done could be used. So yeah, and then some other fabric. So let me put that away. That is beautiful. Thank you so much. Okay, and then some other fabrics. And these look like um, silky ones. So, and then, oh look, a little ruffled edge. I don't know, if, did this come from a garment that you cut up, Cynthia, or did they come like this? Because there's that piece, there's this piece, and then these, nice satiny, uh, gold, burgundy, this uh, rose, this darker rose. It's like three different shades of rose, I think, unless that's brown. I don't know. Ooh, look at this little piece of ribbon. And like an ivory or beige. And these are all silky fabrics. It's fun, fun, fun. My brain, I'm, I'm like trying to think of, hmm, what might I do with those? Those are beautiful. There's that. Okay. And look at these beautiful ruffled laces. There's the pink, the purple, and this teal blue. Love it. And these will definitely be, um, I'll probably use them as uh, in the borders of pages and journals. Check these out. I love it. Does it tell you? These are those uh, edging scissors. This is a scallop. This is another type of scallop. And... Here you go. Three different types of edging scissors. Fun. And, ooh, look at these stamps. Some beautiful stamps. I'm just going to go quickly through them. The birds. Oh, those are fun. Stars. And then some different words. Fun stamps. I'm kind of putting it in front of me and then I'll put it back in the box. 
more little books. Check this out. This is um, another language, Romantisch, right? Maybe German? I don't know. It's a cute little book. I love the cover. It's kind of stained in the back. Oh my goodness, look at the beautiful pictures in it. It's just got some gorgeous images in it. Look at that. Yeah, very pretty. Nice. And uh, these are little journals. <laughs> I don't know if these were from the dollar store or Target dollar spot or someplace. Ooh, and it's got like some little um, words and embellishments like cutouts tucked in there that's fun kind of like planner type stuff so those are neat and these are just journals these okay then there is little positive look at these cute little paper bags awesome there's a, quite a few of them and some more cards oh look at this Oh, that's a postcard and then these are some more beautiful great greeting cards and are these blank inside most of them are, are yeah blank inside this type of cards awesome so let me put these over here with the cards and some sponges these are awesome for inking and ooh, look at this it's a little journal let's see it's all fabric. I love that little fabric flower. And it's got this little button closure here. And it is a needle book. I have never had a needle book. Did you make this, Cynthia? Because it is so pretty. How interesting. So it's got some thick pieces of felt and stuff. And uh, fabric. To, to, you know, put your little needles in there. One second. Okay. You know, family noises. <laughs> okay. So, that is beautiful. So, I've never owned a needle book. But I think that it might be fun to put some of my needles in. I do have different types of needles, you know, just in those little packages. So, that will be fun. <gasps> oh, my goodness. Look at that. And look at this. If this is what the pages look like, this is awesome. So I'm just going to try to do it like this. Can you see it? Okay, let's do it. Huh? Um, I don't know how. I mean, yeah. I don't know. If I could think of a way for you to help me, then sure. Look how pretty. <laughs> that was hubby. He's so sweet. He wanted to help me. Look at these gorgeous drawings. Oh my goodness, that is beautiful. I'm going to have to, this will probably, oh my goodness, I couldn't break. This will probably have to sit, oh look how pretty, have to sit with me out here, kind of like a coffee table book. I don't think I could tear this up unless I found another one like it. It's so pretty. Oh, these are cool. Look, a dictionary for children. These are awesome for pictures too. Let's see if I can hold it. And it's got somebody else's name on it, so I'm sure she probably thrifted it. But yeah, it's, it's great for like images. Oh, look at that. Crutches. Look at the queen. Yeah, it's got awesome. Uh, oh, look at it. It's got a little comic in there. And just cool pictures all around. And definitions are cool. So that is fun. Macmillan Children's Dictionary. Another illustrated children's dictionary. Let's see. Yep. Lots of cool pictures. Nice. And oh my goodness. Oh wow. A nice stack of different scrapbooking papers. Look at this. So I'm going to flip through it like if it was a book. Just, just to make this fast because... I've got so much to go through. <gasps> Look how pretty. Beautiful. Beautiful. I love these colors. Oh my goodness. I love every one of these. Like the colors. 
Oh, and these are double-sided. These are cardstocky. The, these that are flipping now are more cardstocky, like thicker, you know? So these were more like paper. And then the ones in the back, oh, how gorgeous. Look at this. But there's some further back that are double-sided. Let me show you maybe one of the double-sided ones. Look at this. Isn't that pretty? It's double-sided. And I saw some, love these fruit ones with all the gold. And it is double-sided. It's got a little gingham in the back. Oh my goodness, there's, oh, look at the butterflies. Hey, you know, I love me butter butterflies. Hey. And butterflies and fruit. Love it. Hey, Thank you. you. Thank you so much, Cynthia. And pardon the family noises. <laughs> Otherwise, I would never get this done. Okay. Um, wow, that is awesome. So gonna have fun flipping through those books and some of this paper I already know that I want to use it um, for some projects that I want to do it's like ah, I have got projects above projects that I want to do but um, thank you so much this is so fun okay and so far I don't know uh, call me selfish but so far every single thing that I've looked at is stuff that I, that I would love to use uh, but I will definitely share anything that I think I want these for whatever reason, but I don't know. So far, <laughs> you're just excited. Okay, sorry. Look at this fabric. Okay, this is the third box now, going on box number three. Look at this cute little pleated, uh, what do you call it, eyelet lace, and then some pretty fabrics, different pieces of fabrics. Oh my goodness. Jane Daver Davenport. These look like gel. Glitzy sparkle markers. Beautiful. Look at the mermaids there on the packaging. I love it. Okay. Some glitter glue. That's always fun. And these little papers, which got like different. <coughs> Uh, have different uh, like little Disney scenes so those are fun just for coloring so I'm trying to think of who I know that has a little girl because these would be really cute for a little girl although to be honest I'll probably color a couple of these <laughs> uh, so anyway that's that's cool awesome some tools these are this is great this is the, the this tool is great for holding your like um, projects like um, what do you call it like like you're when you're doing jump rings and stuff hold them with with this tool while you work with the other pliers the, your round nose pliers and then a little cutting tool and look how pretty look how pretty I love that um, handle and that and oh my goodness here's some more cards more cards these look like some Christmas cards beautiful let me see look how pretty I will never have to buy cards again <laughs> but some of these you know will go in journals or they will get remade oh look at that so pretty remade so I have a bag of cards here awesome. oh perfect look card basis so this is a uh, craft colored card basis Ooh, just feel feel the quality of them okay so these are the envelopes craft envelopes and then these are the cards that you you know fold to, to make into you know to decorate or whatever to make your own cards this is awesomeness I do love to get those sometimes you get them um on sale at Michael's and they're a good deal but these are awesome because I love the craft color yay and <laughs> okay um not sure what that I thought it was a glow stick for a second but I want to say this is a roller right it's like a roller like to roll maybe I don't know clay or it's got this little rubber 
These look like rubber bands on there. Cynthia, you got to tell me if I'm right about this. If not, what this is for because, <laughs> uh, yeah, um, I need help with that one. Okay, I'm thinking it's a roller. That's what I'm going to go with unless you tell me otherwise. So let me know, okay, or if somebody out there knows what this might be. It's just a very thick piece of plastic, you know, smooth, round, and uh, yeah, very, it's got a nice weight to it. <laughs> so let me know what, what you think it is. Okay. Ooh, looky, looky. I love these colors. Some aluminum wire. There's like all these different colors of it here. Love it. Look at that. So I think I'm going to be playing with these. Um, what I've done with these recently is tried to make like different shaped paper clips. Um, it's very soft wire, so they, they don't come out really sturdy, but they, they come out cute. So I might do that or, you know, there's tons of other things you can do with that. Let me, you know, and with some of these supplies, let me know what you would do with it. And if you have any ideas for me, look at this pretty, pretty pleated ribbon, a little piece there. And then these, what are these? These are acrylic paints, Heidi Swap. <gasps> metallic texture paste look at that and there's this color and then pink and then a darker or this is the same as a, a, a darker one so there's these all these texture pastes really intrigue me because i have not used like a, um like i said the only texture paste i ever used i've ever used is um making it out of the the dollar store excuse me the dollar store Backling, you know, that's the only one I've ever done. Twistable crayons. Nice. Some of the stuff I think I'll probably share with Lane because, like I said, he loves to draw and stuff. That's cool. And, oh my goodness, there's just so much. Okay. Semi-gloss, multi-purpose paint, I guess. Some paint. Look how pretty. Oh, this is Jean Davenport, too. Her packaging is awesome. This is acrylic paint. Acrylic paint. Perler pen. Oh, my goodness. Cynthia, you're like totally spoiled, babe. Look at this pretty trim. It's like a tutu. <laughs> I'm going to call it tutu trim. This is tutu trim. It's so cute. And again, it's like mermaidish colors, right? Mermaidish colors. <laughs> Ooh, more cards. Look how pretty that envelope. See the card that goes with it? It's a cat. Oh, that's a cat. Yeah, there he is. And there he is. And the puppy. A lot of these are animals. Oh, look how beautiful that polar bear. And then matching envelope. Love it. Love the cards awesome and some oh, look at the butterfly it's like uh it looks like it's made out of wood and then the cards are these are made by it says a replica of one of the cards made by rwandan women who participate in the women for women international program isn't that beautiful Love those cards. Awesome. And ooh. More. Okay, so these are seals to some of these cards. Oh my goodness. These long, skinny cards. I don't have very many of these at all, actually. Yeah, I think I've only gotten like one like as a card from Unhappy Mail. But these are so pretty. I love these. I love the, um, you know, the long, thin style. Look, there's more over here with the seals. Wow. More cards. Love them. Love them. Yeah, I think I've already said it, but I don't think I ever have to buy cards ever again. <laughs> so that is awesome. What is Ah, <laughs> look at this. These look like the coffee stirs that I collect at work. I think, is that what it is? Yeah, they are. These little coffee stirs. 
So I, I can actually put the ones that I have that I collect in here too. And I don't know if this was um, a water bottle or some sort of bottle or, or if it's a container like this or shampoo or something, but look at the shape of the top. But it works perfectly for this. Um, for storing these sticks and I actually have some that I'm going to add to that and here's another one with paper straws Ooh, excuse me I'm not used to wearing makeup and I actually put on makeup so I'm really itchy okay silver paper straws and I also have a few paper straws that I collect for crafts that I can put in here I love that storage idea thank you so much Cynthia not just for this but also for the ideas if I find some bottles like this, um, I definitely get them. Here's some more acrylic things and neon colors. Wow. Oh my goodness. And more of these pastes. Look at this. Paste. Let me see. French. Amber. And these are, I'm trying to read one while I show you the other. Artisan. Oh, powder. It says artisan powder. What is this? Is this like, is that like mica? And these are all sealed. You know what? I'm going to have to open one to, to, to find out what it is. I hope I don't spill powder all over the place. Okay, this one is Orlean, Orleans soap. I got to look at it. Sorry, I've never seen anything like this before. So let's see. It looks just like, like a makeup, um, you know, powder that you would use like a finishing powder or stuff but I'm sure that's not what it's for so I am going to have to look into how to use that oh here it is directions lightly dust powder onto resins wood paper or any surface to create an antique vintage look to reveal textures details and cracks of any surface huh I'm just gonna have to play with it this is so cool. Never thought of using like a powder for texture, you know? So yeah, here's some more of this pretty papers. Where did I put those? Okay. And oh my goodness, <laughs> there's still like a whole couple pom-pom paper clips. And look at this, washi tape. And these are all like Paris theme in this little container, container like spool. See where you can, um, that is so cute. I love, you know how much I love washi and I have been restraining myself from purchasing any and now I have a whole bunch more that I can put in my washi tape collection book. Thank you so much, Cynthia. Look at this pretty ribbon. It reminds me of Minnie Mouse, even though it's pink, but it's so cute. And look at this, guys. A whole container full of more little um, pastes and powders and paints and inks. So I'm not going to go in and pull out each one of them. I'm just showing you. Look at that. Is that amazing? Thank you so much, Cynthia. I totally, totally I'm set for life here. Thank you. Look at this awesome big paper clip. This is awesome because I have some longer stamps that, um, like clear stamps that I hadn't been able to, that I've just been using just with the stamp, you know, because I didn't have a, a block for it. These are awesome. Stamp blocks. Oop, there's a couple more. More daubers. And check this out there's a couple more of these stamp blocks here and again looks like more pastes and paints and even some markers and sorry for the glare <laughs> what is this I want to see what this says velvet pastel velours is that Jane Davenport also it is I don't know I'm going to have to look a lot of this stuff up. I know I keep saying that. I'm sorry if I sound repetitive, but really, I have so much to learn. So much to learn. And now I have all these materials that I can use to, to learn with. So thank you so much. Okay, that was box number three. 
let me trade it over here with another one. Um, sorry, Trinity. And I already see something I totally love in here. Box number four. Look how gorgeous that is. I love that. It's a little zip. Um, it's like a wristless. I could almost use this like a little purse, you know. <laughs> it's so cute. So I'm, I'm definitely going to have to think of what special thing to keep in here. I love it. So I want to keep that with me at my craft desk. Thank you so much, Cynthia. I love it. Paper plates. Just <laughs> a couple of these. That's awesome. Um, some more cards. Flat like this, but look at how pretty that bird there. And some <laughs> word stamps. <laughs> I love the first one. I'm not fat, I'm just easy to see. <laughs> Shut up and color. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. And some stickers. Beautiful. Oh my goodness, beautiful. Some more gorgeous cards. Look at this. Look at these gorgeous cards. And envelopes. These, they almost look like wood. Wood grain envelopes. And the cards are going it. That is so cool. Oh, my card bag is getting full. <laughs> I might have to get another one. Okay. A mini glue gun with glue sticks awesome i already have a pretty nice glue gun so this i'll probably end up paying forward so you, can, you guys can be on the lookout for that all right Ooh, let's see another cute little pouch let's see it's got some goodies in it just some little pretty um clips and a ooh a top see lay in here come here honey have you played with a top before? I'm sure you have. Look, spins. You want it? Yeah. It actually matches his shirt. Oops, he's wearing green today. <laughs> Fun, huh? And <laughs> look at these. These are adorable. Hello Kitty bunnies. <laughs> and they're just the little tins. So it came with sweet stuff in it, but that is cute to just drop in little things, right? Or store little things in, or gift little things in. Cute, fat pen, Mary Englebright pen, and, and I did put this stuff in here, like I told you, my husband and I went through some of this stuff before, so look at this pretty um, Ziploc or zip bag, cute pen, <laughs> a little dog pen, uh, a pencil sharpener, pencil, and okay, I gotta ask you, Cynthia, did you make these? These are gorgeous. Look at these earrings. I love these earrings tangling them look at that is that beautiful so I'm gonna set those aside because I will probably wear those I love those actually that go perfect with my what I'm wearing my Tinkerbell shirt I'm wearing my um, butterfly earrings that I made but these will go perfect with this shirt I think I'm gonna have to use them when I wear this shirt next time, <laughs> I'm gonna put those aside, okay? And then these are awesome. This is the type of stuff my husband and I used to pick up when we used to do thrifting for eBay. But I just love these. I'm gonna find a little shelf to put these in. Ter Perry the platypus. This is Aurora, I believe. These little zoom zoom characters. Donald. <laughs> <laughs> Am I going to go through all of them? Why not? This is uh, Olaf. And is that the rabbit from Alice? I want to say, maybe. 
Mickey. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is just too fun. Piglet. Look how cute he is. Oh my goodness. <sighs> I hope this is not too boring, guys. I'm I'm just having so much fun. Look at the tiny Pluto. <laughs> I love it. And then who's this? That's Cinderella. And Anna, I believe, from Frozen. Look at that. <laughs> wow. These are awesome. Thank you so much, Cynthia. I'm having so much fun. Just Even just going through over there, I'm having so much fun. But it's going to be even more fun to play with some of this stuff. But these are going to go on a little shelf, for sure. <laughs> because I'm a big kid that way, right? <laughs> All right, let's see what else. Oh my goodness, this is awesome. Look at this. I had actually been thinking that I wanted one of these. I've seen Gail Agostinelli when she works in her journals using a little book weight. That's what this is, see? It's a little book weight. So when the journals, you know, they're kind of fat or, you know, are wanting to close, you put this weight on there to keep, keep it open. I love it. Thank you. I'm going to keep it out because I'm, I'm going to probably use that soon. And look at these awesome silicone brushes. I have never found these. And I've been wanting to try these out. Like for um, you, gluing, you know. Because then um, when you use a regular brush, obviously the bristles get all stuck together. But this is already, you know, solid. That's what I think I want to use them for, but I'm sure they have other uses. That is so cool. Glory. I was trying to read the brand, but yeah, thank you. I love these. These are this is actually some of the things that I've wanted to try out that I haven't found before. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Look, little ugly sweaters. I mean, they're cute, but you know, they're the like, ugly sweater <laughs> are these cute little Christmas ornaments oh that is precious these are actually gonna go on my tree there uh, Cynthia <laughs> I love 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 them awesome thank you okay let me put this side over here and let's see what's in here I love boxes what's in here Oh my goodness, it's got a whole bunch of different papers, so, oh, so in here it looks like maybe scraps, or yeah, some paper scraps, ooh, there's a tag, did you collage that, that is pretty, look at those tags that she collaged, I recognize some of this paper from what you sent me there. And then some other pieces, just little, little, I'm sorry, little pieces. That is so cute. Let me see this one. It's got this little trim on it. That is adorable. So little pieces of paper, a couple of her collaged tags, and then some embellishments. Look how cute those are. All kinds of different flowers. These look like she may have fussy cut some of them from from paper pads and stuff. Looks like some of them she may have fussy cut or they were cutouts. And then these, these look like they might be bow bunny or they look similar to some other ones that, that she had sent me before. <laughs> so thank you. I love, love, love those. Especially tags. I'm gonna have to pull out the tags and put them in my, uh, my friend binder. Actually, let me do that. Let me take those out. Those are in my friend binder. <laughs> okay. And these are cool. What's this? Oh, post-it notes that you can wrap around like a um, handle or something. Those are neat. Never seen that. But look at these. These are like Ziploc baggies, you know, for storage. Um, or like to send, you know, little gifts. Okay, so it's clear on one side and metallic on the other side. Excuse me, I keep scratching my nose. Those are cool, a bunch of those. Oh, look, the natural history of Britain. Oh, look, the squirrel. 
I love squirrels too. Let me, let's look through this book. Oh, look at the pretty end papers. I'm gonna have my face on the side here because I wanna be able to see. Oh my goodness, look how pretty. Oh, what was that picture? Oh, how gorgeous, look at that. These are amazing. Oh my goodness. Where did you find this book? Oh, that is gorgeous. Again, this is one I wish I, oh, I had duplicates because it's like, I don't want to cut into this, but I want to cut into it. <laughs> that is awesome. It looks like it was a library book originally, so I can even take this pocket out if I can get it, you know. This is amazing. Wow. Then a pretty calendar that's got these images in it. And then some, looks like photo mats. These are cool. And then, hold on, I have stuff on my lap because I want to put it back in this box. <laughs> my nose is really itching now. Oh, actually this one my husband saw when I went, we peeked in here before and he's going to be using this. So thank you for that. It's just a notebook. But he really liked it. With the eagle there and kind of all black and you know, very manly actually. So that's going to be for hubby. Some more photo mats. Look how pretty. Mostly black and gray, like marble. These are neat. Mm -hmm. And we're actually going to be redoing some photos that will come in handy. A little notebook. I think this notebook <coughs> matches the pen. Do I have the pen over here? I don't know where I put the pen that I showed you earlier, but that is cute. Some magnetic words. These are fun. They're just right phrases and stuff on the refrigerator. Another set of cards. Cardinal thank you cards. Oh my goodness. So much goodness. Some books. Sky tree. How pretty is that? So it looks like different seasons. The same tree in different times of the year. Beautiful. Another calendar. It's got all these pictures in it. Neat. And the Easter Seals calendar. These are awesome. Oh, it doesn't have the pictures of but it's got these awesome, large um, pictures of flowers. These are awesome. Oh, oh, I love that one. Oh, my goodness. I am so using this one, like, soon. I need to, okay, this one's getting put aside over here because I have to use it. <laughs> this one has the pictures of the images on the back. And this one. <laughs> I'm like looking, I don't like this. It's got all of these pictures in there. Oh, look at that, how cute. Awesome. Another Easter Seals one. Let's just kind of flip through. Beautiful. Yep. And another Easter Seals. I think maybe she donated the Easter Seals. <laughs> beautiful okay some glittery foam that's interesting animal babies a little book on animal babies let's look at it how adorable sorry that you're not seeing all the full pictures on everything that is so cute oh These are awesome. Thank you so much. You, it's like so right up my alley, all this stuff. Oh my goodness, look at this one. Look at that spread right there. Raccoons, so cute. Sticker stories. Look at that beautiful butterfly right there. So it's got stickers. 
and the sink. Oh, look, butterfly stickers and other buggies. <laughs> oh, look at the butterfly stickers. I could definitely use those elsewhere as well as these backgrounds. There, there's another one. They are so cool. Awesome. <gasps> Love it. Love it. Read aloud rhymes. Another children's book. And ooh, look at this. Look at the end papers. And it's kind of coming off, but that's you know great because that just encourages me to, to use it more <laughs> when it's falling apart. Let's look. Okay, it's got some pretty images. Aw. Oh look at the dinosaur. Very nice. So much to work with. This is awesome. I'm definitely going to have to make more journals. I'm going to have to step up my game in making journals because I've got a lot of fun supplies to use. Look at this. <laughs> Another little bag. Cute. I love those little bags, by the way. They're awesome. So let me put all this bag in here. How much? This is already 40 minutes, so um, I... Oh, I think I, I said in the first video, this might be long. I think I'll cut it here and make a third video for the last two boxes. So these are four boxes I've gone through so far. Oh my goodness. Ah! So two more boxes to go. Come back in the next video.